What's the matter? No, we're, nothing, nothing to be alarmed about. Well, of course it is, because you're, you're compromising our security. No, no. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we are at Arriva. The Bus depot in Leicestershire. Yeah. Quite a big site, this one. It is really big, big. So, the gates are open, so let's go have a closer look inside. Wow, look at them bus, uh, bus washes. <laughs> I was going to say car wash then, but... Car wash? It's a bit big for a car, Dee. Bit big for a car, eh? Just a little bit. So we've got a lot of parking spaces for when they come back later. Let's follow the pedestrian footpath and have a little look. Let's see if there's a, an office where we can buy a bus pass or something like that. Yeah. See what services they offer the public at this particular building. Hi. Uh, which one's the entrance? Is it? Next one. Cheers. It says exit. Yeah, don't worry about that. <laughs> don't worry about that. Don't worry about the exit sign. Close, no access. No, wow. I was Oh, is that the uh, pass? That's the pass machine. Start deposit. Oh no, this is where the drivers put their money in at the end of the day. Oh, is it? Sorry, who are you guys? We're, we're just the members of the public. Um, we're just taking an interest in the local area and we're, we're documenting it for, for our purposes. This is right, not the... This I appreciate is, that, but you can't video in here. The door's open to the public. The door's not open to the public. The door's open at the moment because it should be locked, but obviously because of COVID and stuff, we're trying to reduce the touch points. Oh, right. Um, do you know, is this got like a machine where you can buy a pass? That's not it, is it? No, 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 no. Just... What's the matter? Mm. No, we're... Nothing, nothing to be alarmed about. Well, of course it is, because you're, you're compromising our security. No, no, nothing to be alarmed about. So yeah. you can't just walk in. What, what's it regarding this? Um, we're just the members of the public. It's called citizen journalism. Right. We do some recording of interesting places. Yeah. Um, when the members of the public come into, into this building... Well, this, this is private property. You can't just walk in and ask. You can't just come stop. No, I've, I've only got a few questions. Is it? Can you buy bus passes here or not? No. No? No, no. This is, this is, this is definitely where we run the buses from. So where do you buy your bus passes from? You have to buy them online. You can all buy them from there. Oh, you're joking. Yeah, you can't buy uh, So, So, like, if we just want to take some you're photos... You're me, are you? If we just want to take some no, photos... are you filming me? Yeah. Right, well, I didn't ask you. Right, well, you need to leave on the plate. Well, That's not a good me. reaction for the company, for a reaver. This no, is... I don't know don't... who you are. You can't just walk in. No, the door was opened. We... One of your colleagues instructed us to come in this door. Which, which colleague? The one's outside. Some colleagues stood out there, haven't on the break, instructed us to come into this door. Right, so we don't. And, and, and you can come in if it's lost property and stuff like that, but you can't just go oh. the cameras and start filming. So the like public can come here to. Only if it's lost property. Uh, anything else? Because I, I want to get good information. Right, what are you after? I'm, I'm after about what this place does. Although it stores the buses overnight and it may be refilling with fuel and the drivers may put their coins in there and stuff, when a member of the public comes here, what, what can you offer them? Is it just lost property? Yeah, they can ask for information, timetables and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, timetables. Time, like, 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 bus inquiries or if it's uh, what, what bus do I need to catch at this point, we can give them a lot of time information. This is but, perfect. This is perfect. But not other, you can't just otherwise just walk in and. No. Uh, this is what we do. We, we turn up and announce to find out bits of information that will benefit the local community. Sometimes we get a good reaction, sometimes we don't. Yeah. But, but the intention is for positive, positive endings. Yeah, but you can understand from our point of view, just come in and ask them. Yeah, but we just walk past, and which is the entrance? Is it open? It says, yeah, it's the next one. So they, we, we're directed in here by the people outside. Who, so who's that? Who's that? Is it drivers or drivers? Whoever's in the corner having a fag. So, you know, it's... All these people out here? Yeah. yeah, I don't know if they're still there or not. But anyway, um, if there's nothing else to uh, to see in here, then we may as well just get, get going. That's it, I mean, it, was it, was it that one the way in? Is, it, is that door the way in? Uh, the public, yeah, yeah, there you go. Public, go in there. Sorry? 
No. So, so as you say, um, yeah. your reaction was a little bit over the top um, for me. I, I don't want you caused me a little bit of a, a alarm and distress there by telling me I couldn't be in there. So well, yeah, normally we don't allow the members of the public in there because we're actually in a cluster at the minute. So what normally they do, they come to that window there and ask, they ask for permission. You know. Well, we're just doing what we're told, and it doesn't say speak, speak to the window. Yeah. So when when the local community are, I wouldn't want them to have the same reaction. But the local community they normally just come and ask like straight away, like they cut a bit more. Uh, they ask the questions about the timetable and stuff. We've asked. We walk. We walk down here. We says, which is the best door to use, mate, for the public? Yeah. And so it was when that you one. went in there. What did you say to my colleague in there? I says, well, he was on the phone. Yeah. So I says, is this the ticket machine where we buy ticket, where we buy um, passes? Because it looked like it. But then I, I realised it was where the drivers deposit their money at the end of the day. And then it's. So, it, well, can I just say to you, you've not asked for my permission. You've got your camera on there. Yeah. Under GDPR, you have to ask me whether I want my film, and I do not want to. Yeah. So you, if you use that without my permission, it will be used without your permission. It, it will be. Then I, I will take it further. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so, would you like me to explain the law? I do know the law because we run a bus company. Yeah. yeah and you, you, not, you do not my authority to use my pictures. As a business, as a reaver, yeah. you have to protect data. So you have to protect your GDPR applies to you as a member of the public. Yeah. I don't abide by any GDPR rules. Filming you and yeah. on social media, would you prefer, you'd appreciate that? Um, you're, you're entitled to, my friend. No, I'm not entitled. You are? No, but, because we don't allow our drivers to do that. Well, that's your policy. Yeah. But because I'm not employed by Arriva, yeah. I don't follow your policy. I only follow UK law. Yeah. And this is the typical conversation that we have when we do our type of work. Yeah. And it's very entertaining. So you're providing me entertainment just by saying these ridiculous things. Right, I think I've, also, I've explained myself. Yeah, yeah. I just wish you a good day. Yeah. I need to get back on with you. I appreciate that, my friend. And um, what was your name? You don't need to know my name. Okay, okay. Thank you. So, have we got some good shots? Or... Got yeah, got a few good shots there. I, I don't fancy um, walking in the, the busy area. I'm just going to call it a day on this one yeah you happy yeah i'm happy right okay okay <clears throat> it's always good entertainment in these sort of places <laughs> oh you don't look very happy does it <laughs> all right let me go in front let me go in front right so guys arriva bus depot in fermiston in leicester oh dear some people eh it was interesting to see that machine where the drivers put that money. I always wondered what they do, um, how they get the money into the um, into the system, whether they count it or what. But anything else to say, Jay? Nope. Right, well, it's bye-bye from me. Bye-bye from me. And we'll see you on the next one, guys. That has been Arriva Bus Depot in Leicester. Bye-bye. <laughs>